Welcome back to another one of my uh, Unraveling Toxic Masculinity. And this series that I'm going to be creating is one dedicated to Pearl or just pearly things or somebody I call Pick Me Pearl. Somebody who uh, loves to stand up for and fight for toxic masculinity right along with her so-called alpha male dude bros. And you'll see why with this first one because holy crap this one is a doozy let's go ahead and start over from the start and you'll see why right, as it reloads just to make sure it starts from the beginning and you're telling me that a guy that has women throwing themselves at him 24 7 had to rape somebody that doesn't make sense to me well i don't think women coming no, i don't think i don't think you can make the leap that that couldn't happen i didn't say it couldn't i'd say it's very unlikely like is elon musk is he gonna rob a bank <laughs> probably not i think it's certainly less likely but he could do it and you're telling me all right there we go there's the problem with the logic of the pick me pearls of the world is that just because somebody has women throwing themselves at him, that doesn't mean that he could rape. Uh, clearly, that is an illogical statement made by an illogical person. Uh, one has nothing to do with the other. Uh, people who feel entitled to whatever it is that they want to get are probably more likely uh to commit acts of sexual assault against other people and so if he feels that he's entitled to whatever that he whatever he can get and somebody says no he might feel upset and then want to force himself on that person uh that is one thing that could be a possible explanation as to why russell brand uh might have forced himself into something but then again there's the other conversation is the fact that this person that Russell Brand is accused of sexually assaulting is underage and as such doesn't matter if the person wanted it or not because the person is un incapable of consenting in the first place. And as such, it's still rape regardless of if it's a yes or a no. So there you go. And a whole Elon Musk bank thing. Well, there are rich people who steal money all the time. There are rich money who have rich people who embezzle money there are rich people who violate all sorts of rules when it comes to making money all the time why because they feel that they're entitled to it they feel that the, just because they're rich and popular and powerful and successful that they're able to get away with it so why would somebody like russell brand do such a thing because he's rich and powerful and popular and it feels entitled and feels that he could probably get away with it too. So that's why he feels that he could get away with such a thing most likely. That's why your argument, pick me pearl, is horrible.